Hey everyone, Mike Vogel here for the Monumental Sports Network and going through our conversations with 2018 Caps draftees joined by defenseman Martin Fairvari. And Martin, you're chosen in the second round, 46th overall. Did you have an idea that, that the Caps were interested in you? Uh, I didn't have uh, any idea. Like uh, the draft is more like a lottery, so uh, uh, whatever can happen. But uh, I had a really great meeting at the NHL Combine, so uh, uh, Caps was one of the favorite. And you've had an interesting season too. You, you um, by all accounts, played very well at the World Championship, uh, playing against men just uh, a couple of months ago. What was that experience like for you? And why do you think you had success playing against NHL players and, and, and men in that tournament? Uh, I mean, it uh, helps me a lot in this season. Uh, also in the draft, uh, the play players like uh, Paul Datsyuk or the team Sweden, I mean, uh, one of the best of the world. And I think uh, it helps me a lot during the season too. And uh, I think great experience. Like I said, uh, the players and uh, the tempo of the game was really high. Growing up in, in Slovakia, which players did you enjoy watching or did you maybe pattern or model your game after? My favorite player was uh, always Lubomir Vishnovsky from Slovakia, mm. like the Slovak player. I follow him all the way. And uh, now like he finished, I really like the Andrei Sekera from the Edmonton. Uh, I follow mostly the, uh, the Slovak guys, uh, but also like watching the, really a lot of the NHL and the Washington too. Zdeno Chara, we had a we had a pretty good uh, Slovakian defenseman here, probably probably about ten years ago. Milan Yurchina was a, had a, a couple of good seasons here. But even as a 16-year-old, you were able to go and play a few games in the uh, in the Swedish league, which is a pretty good league too. How much do you think that helped your your development? Uh, I mean, uh, I'm really glad to get that opportunity. And uh, 16 years old. Uh, wasn't even expect that uh, I got a chance, but I got this, and uh, I think it was a great, like uh, 16 years old uh, as a kid, I would mm -hmm. say, and uh, playing against the players who play already the NHL couple games, so uh, it helped me a lot in my growing career. So, really nice experience. How has this week been for you? What have you, what have you learned, and and how have you found the the, the facilities and and the city and, and the area? Uh, I mean, great, a great week. I really enjoyed it. I'm trying to get better every day. The coaches uh, here and staff are really great. So I'm trying to be better, uh, trying to learn as much as I can. And uh, really fun to play against the, those players, like uh, the prospects too. So really enjoyed it. How would you describe yourself uh, as a defenseman? I would say I'm a two-way defender, uh, trying to play more uh, defensively, like uh, being helpful, uh, helpful for the team, uh, play a lot of PKs. But if I could have a chance, I like to join the rush and play some offense too. I mean, what areas of your game do you feel like you need to work on to, to achieve your goal of, of playing in the NHL? I think I need to uh, work on every, every, every part of game, especially the offense part of game. Uh, I'm trying to be um, uh, better with the puck, with a quicker with the puck, and uh, the, dishes, the decisions with the puck needs to be uh, much faster if I want to play an NHL. So I think I'm on a good way, so just keep on going. What is your plan for uh, the season ahead? Are you, I think it's HV71, is that where you're yeah. going to be? Uh, are you planning on playing there for just one year and coming to North America, or maybe staying, staying there a little longer? I would like to play just one year there, one season, and then I would like to come over uh, and uh, make the NHL. Awesome. And uh, last question before we let you go. Uh, there's about two months here before you'll be back here for main training camp in early September. How, how do you plan on spending th those two months? Uh, actually, I'm uh, coming back to Slovakia to home and practice home till uh, end of July. Uh, then after I will move to Sweden uh, for rest of the of the summer and then I will head here to uh, the camp. Awesome. We'll look forward to seeing you then. Thanks to Martin Fehervari for spending some time with us today here on the Monumental Sports Network.